Fabrication of uniform green perovskite light emitting diode via sandwich evaporation technique. Perovskite light emitting diodes are, have recently attracted great attention due to their narrow emission and high color purity. Differing from the current thin film perovskite forming method, as you can see from the picture below, in this experiment, MAPBBR3 thin film were started with commercially available ITO glasses as the substrates, which were ultrasonically cleaned sequentially by deionized water, acetone, isopropyl alcohol, and methanol for 15 minutes each. The P dot PSS was filtered by 0.2 millimeter filter before use. We spin coated at 4,000 RPM for 30 seconds and annealed at uh, 120 degrees Celsius for 10 minutes in ambient air. To fabricate the MAPBBR3 perovskite layer, MABR was spin coated as the first layer of the sandwich deposition method and then used an evaporator to deposit it. Uh, uh, PBBR2 as the second layer, and finally use a self-made chamber to evaporate MAPBR as the last layer. After completing the MAPBBR3 crystalline film, TPBI was spin coated at uh, 2000 RPM for 45 seconds in nitrogen glove box. LIF and silver were deposited successfully by the thermal evaporation method. Finally, the device were packaged uh, by enclosing the cover glass in a nitrogen glove box. The SEM image of the cross section is shown in figure 2A. The thickness of MAPBBR3 is 213 uh, nanometer. Figure 1B shows that the grand size of crystalline MAPBBR3 is about 300 nanometer. By using SDT, it is possible to produce well-crystallined, flat, and uniform perovskite thin film with narrow full width and half maximum photoluminance spectrum under blue light stimulation. As shown in figure 1B and E, the optimal perovskite LED gave the maximum luminance of about 392 CD per meter squared. Uh, the maximum current efficiency of about uh, 0.046 TD per ampere and the maximum external quantum efficiency of about 0.108%.